Hello everyone and welcome to another review. Today we're going to go ahead and review a fragrance that was released in the year of 2010. The fragrance is from the house of Calvin Klein. We're talking about Eternity Aqua. Now Eternity Aqua is a scent that I had picked up such a long time ago and had gotten rid of it just as quick. I remember uh, purchasing it when I went to the mall. This was when I was like... Uh, yeah, it was a long time ago, uh, but I remember purchasing it when I went to the mall and ended up uh, giving it back just because there was another fragrance that I had wanted to get and I kind of wanted to budget things out. So it was a pleasant surprise to actually come across the fragrance again and go ahead and review it. Now, it's available in a couple of sizes, ranging from one ounce to 6.7 ounces. Uh, the 6.7 ounce is going to retail for around $90 retail, uh, but I have seen the 6.7 as cheap at, or as inexpensive as $30. So do some searching around. You can find the scent heavily discounted and also be cautious because you can find the scent heavily copied. This is a, a fragrance that has been copied many times over. And when I say copied, I mean fakes. I don't necessarily mean, you know, legit copies. I strictly mean fakes. So watch out when you're purchasing this actual scent. Without any further ado, let's just go ahead and get into the notes of this fragrance. Notes of the fragrance are listed on screen. Biggest takeaway here is this cucumber aquatic note that you get with this scent. And the funny thing about this scent was I remember why I actually took it back because there was another scent. There was another reason why I had taken it back and that was because it smelled like another fragrance that I had at the time. And the fragrance at the time, it still smells like to this day, memories came rushing back, it smells like Polo Blue. Polo Blue was, I think, the second scent that I got in my collection, right behind Michael Jordan, um, the Michael Jordan cologne, the standard cologne. And I remember smelling it and thinking, man, these two smell really similar to it. And now that I'm able to articulate more what it was about it, it's really that cucumber aquatic vibe that is the same. And even the dry down, once you start getting more of the woods, uh, it really resembles Polo Blue and the two are very similar to the point where if you have one, I would suggest you don't really need the other. But I really do like the Cucumber Aquatic Vibe because it gives it this nice freshness. Cucumber uh, is generally kind of put in uh, water, if you will, cucumber infused water, and it comes across as refreshing. And that's what this scent comes across as, like a refreshing scent. You spray it on you when you're right out of the shower, you smell clean, you smell energized, and you're ready to go. And that's what this really kind of pushes across really well. The fragrance lasts roughly about six to eight hours on my skin. It's one that has a decent amount of projection and has a good amount of sillage. After that six to eight hours, it becomes more of a skin scent on you, but that skin scent remains like a, I guess you could say like a watery, woody type of a scent. <clears throat> That's very generic, but at the same time, it still is a pleasant smelling scent. And for that reason, this is a scent that I recommend that you can go ahead and easily wear for work. It can be a staple for your work smelling scent because it's just a very pleasant scent in that manner. Uh, I would hesitate to wear this one on you know date or nights out for that matter uh, just because it doesn't really stand out enough and i don't really think it's a sensual enough fragrance to be that manner it's a good fragrance for any age group doesn't matter how old or how young you are i think this is a good fragrance that goes with almost any season um, and it really kind of sticks out from that and compliment wise i did get one compliment on this fragrance uh, but I kind of view compliments in the same realm as I view Polo Blue just because I, they're so freaking similar. Uh, and for that matter, it is a pretty decent smelling uh, fragrance and it will get you compliments if, with a big caveat, if you have somebody who isn't used to fragrances. Um, and I know that sounds really strange, but one of the frequent comments that I had from people when I had them smell it was it's it smells great but it smells like uh, a typical guy it smells like axe body wash uh, if you will it smells like the, you know that typical clean smelling you know kind of uh just clean smelling scent is essentially what this comes across as so you know take with it what you will in terms of that realm so if i'm going to go ahead and give this fragrance a rating I give this fragrance a rating three out of five stars. At the end of the day, this is a kind of a solid middle of the road. Now I know I didn't give it two and a half out of five stars for truly middle of the road, but 
I really do like that cucumber freshness that comes with this scent. Uh, unfortunately, you know, there is another scent out there just like it, Polo Blue, uh, but that doesn't detract away from it. Um, surprisingly, it's one that I more kind of like, more from the Calvin Klein line. I don't really like a lot of the Calvin Klein fragrances, uh, but this one does a pretty decent job of its own. The Euphoria series from Calvin Klein I like, but this one, eh, you know, it just kind of is, eh, whatever. Um, but at the end of the day, if you're looking for a work scent, a clean smelling work scent that you can go ahead and put on uh, and that will have decent performance, go ahead and check this fragrance out. It is also inexpensive, which is also a bonus. And take a look down below, I'll place a link where you can get this one discounted as well too. So uh, just keep a watch out for that. Um, and that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think about this scent, even how you think it compares to some of the other fragrances and citrusy fragrances that are out there. Always curious. Thank you guys, take care of yourselves, and you guys have a great day.